Why not? Um, my name is Brogan. Mm-hmm. Um, I've been in Guatemala for three weeks now. Um, maybe uh, two weeks around the lake. Mm-hmm. Um, and uh, San Pedro is my favorite place so far. Okay, why? Uh, I love the people. Okay. Um, uh, we've had some good parties. Okay. And the San Pedro school. Um, I've loved it here as well. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Uh, yeah. Okay. Great. So uh, I I have uh, a little questions uh, for yeah. you. If um, in your experience, do you need that people who wants to come to Guatemala or Latin America needs mm. to speak Spanish before, or what do you think about? It? Um, I when I came, mm-hmm. I didn't speak any Spanish, um, but being here has made me want to uh, be able to talk. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, being here in. Guatemala has made me want to learn Spanish so okay. I can interact with the locals. Um, so, but there's there's school you can learn at school. So okay, yeah. nice. So, the question, the the answer is uh, yes. You need or not? Uh, you don't need to, but um, it's good for you to learn. Yeah. Yeah. Because you can speak with the people, yeah. local people. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Sounds good. And in the school, how was, how do you feel your progress studying here at school? Um, the last couple of days, I've made lots of progress. Um, okay. I need to continue because mm-hmm. um, I've got the basics, but uh, now I know some Spanish. Okay. Um, I want to le- I want to know more. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Nice. And what's your plan after Guatemala or after San Pedro? Where you're going? Uh, after San Pedro, we go to El Paradon. Okay. For a couple of days, and then Antigua mm-hmm. to um, do the volcano tour. Okay. Nice. Sounds um, great. Yeah, and then we'll start to head down south more, South America. Okay. So, how many time you're going to travel? Um. So we've been traveling a, a month over a month. So we've got like. Three months left. Okay. Three nice. or four months, yeah. And then uh, come back to home. Uh, go back to England okay. and see family, work and save some money and then okay. come back. <laughs> <laughs> and what's your work in England? Uh, my job in England is uh, a horse trainer. Again, horse, please? Horse horse riding, horse trainer. Already? Ah, yeah. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah. And, okay, I, don't, I, I know that here in Guatemala it's not a very famous sport mm. because it's a sport, right? Yeah. So, how do you feel about that? Do you see something? Uh, uh um, for here in, in Guatemala, it's the horses are used more for tours and seeing, yeah. but in England, um, it's competitive. Yeah. Um, so yeah, it's a competitive sport. Okay. Um, and it's yeah, it's really big. Lots yeah. yeah lots when of people. You, when you talk about when you talked about uh, this, I remember the Peaky Blunders. Did you see? Yeah. Did you watch that movie? <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Because it's in England, right? Yes, that I was think, in England. Or, uh, yeah. yeah, yeah, back, way back. Yeah, okay, <laughs> <laughs> nice. Um, so, why you should recommend Guatemala? What's the reasons that people should visit Guatemala for you? Um, for me, to um, see the culture and the local people, see how different it is to live here and how lucky we are. To have what we have, because some people here don't have a lot. Yeah, yeah, I know. It's 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 a good point. Yeah. Um, okay. Uh, and it's beautiful as well. Yeah, <laughs> I know. <laughs> yeah, I think most of the people think. I'm sorry. Yeah. Yeah. Most of the people uh, who never been in Guatemala or never have a friend who been in Guatemala have the idea that Guatemala is dangerous. Mm. And I know that like another part of the world it's, it's dangerous but in your experience how do you feel uh, so traveling the, through Guatemala the places I've been in Guatemala I feel safe um, I've been Mexico maybe not so safe I felt mm-hmm. a little bit uh, scared sometimes but I have felt happy here not yeah. scared at all yeah yeah nice and uh, yeah what, what's what do you think about Guatemala before to come uh, before, that is that is wrong. That is wrong. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah. To be honest, before I came, I didn't know a lot about Guatemala. Okay. Um, I never even thought I would visit Guatemala. It wasn't yeah. on my um, 
list of countries, but mm -hmm. my friends um, told me about Guatemala and I researched. Um, so now I wanted to come, but yeah. I didn't. I really didn't know a lot about the country, so okay, it's hard to answer that one. Yeah, yeah. Um, and in general, how how do you feel that is Guatemala? It's cheap or expensive? Um, so we started our trip in Mexico, um, on like the Car Caribbean Caribbean side, I mm -hmm. guess you say, uh, and it was expensive. So like Tulum, yeah, it was really expensive. Okay. So to come here, it was um, cheap. Yeah. Um, especially compared to England. Okay. Yeah. And just for people uh, have an idea, how, what you can do with one hundred dollars here. One hundred dollars. Um, oh, one hundred euros or a pounds. Pound. One hundred yeah. pounds. Um, a lot. Okay. Um, so if I got a hundred pounds out, so ten ten quetzal for us in England is a pound. Yeah. Okay. So. Um, a pound in England wouldn't really get you mm -hmm. anything, yeah. really. Um, but here, you could buy like a bracelet or a cake or something. A beer. Yeah, a beer. Okay. Um, so yeah, you get um, more for your money here. Okay. Yeah. That's it. Thank yeah. you very much. And uh, just to finish, yeah. uh, do you have some message for people who wants to come to Guatemala? Um, even if you've never thought about coming, definitely come to experience the local people and the beautiful countryside. Yeah. Okay, thank you very yeah. much. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Nice. Is that okay? Yes, <laughs> perfect. <laughs>